All of this is happening. Binance has temporarily paused some fund withdrawals. It's going to be doing a swap. Let's check in with Jared Blickery about all of this. This has to do not with Bitcoin, Jared, but with U.S. dollar coin. Yes, USDC, they have temporarily paused withdrawals. Uh, they say that, will, well, if it's temporary, they should be able to resume. And they'll, so they are saying they have to do behind the scenes a token swap for some of those assets. Uh, we'll leave the details up to them. But I just want to show you what's going on in cryptocurrency world. Actually, a lot of green here. And we're going to get to why that is in a second. But I do want to pull up BNB. That is the uh, token for Binance. That is its namesake token here. And you can see largely underwater over the past 24 hours, although it is well off of those lows. So with everything going on with the large, with cracks maybe showing in the largest exchange in the world, uh, San Bankman freed under arrest. Uh, we have charges from the SEC now, charges from the CFTC coming. All of this, what mattered today in terms of what's moving cryptocurrency is CPI. That's all it took was an undershoot on this report. And because that report is so levered to the Fed and its monetary policy decisions, that is what is uh, goosing this risk asset right now. So that is a significant move of 5%. That is a lot more than anything we've seen uh, in equities. And just take a look on a one month basis. It is definitely broken through uh, to the upside this range. So I think at the end of the day, it really only comes down to the Fed. And wouldn't that be par for the course for this year's guy? Yours, right. guys. Yahoo Finance's own Jared Blickery. A lot to continue to cover within the crypto space. Thanks so much for taking a look at some of the tick by tick here that we're tracking.